Robert Show Kitchen this morning with our roadie deal of the day. Chef uh, Steve McLaughlin is here. Eddie's Barbecue uh, is just, look, I mean, if you love barbecue like I do, most people do, you can head on down to Eddie's Barbecue. Roadie deal of the day. So we're going to make uh, pulled pork Reuben with butternut squash hash. Head on to roadiedeals.com right now. Get two $25 vouchers for only 25 bucks. And when you do go down there, you can have something delicious like this. Yep. So today we have uh, butternut squash hash okay. and a pulled pork Reuben. The yep. butternut squash hash butternut cubed up, pepper, ginger, garlic, uh, cra uh, craisins, cranberries, dried cranberries, whatever works, Right. Um, and a little bit of oil to kind of bring it together, flavoring, and then the pulled pork Reuben. So it's, uh, we braise our pulled pork for about three and a half, four hours, and we got sauerkraut, marble rye, Swiss cheese, and then we have a um, an avocado chipotle ranch. So it's good. kind of a combination of different sauces, it brings the whole sandwich together, and we fry it. Uh, put it on the flat top and put it all together. Now we were saying this before, if someone is on their way to the beach, on their way home from the beach, maybe you don't want seafood, maybe you want some barbecue, I'm sure while you're while you're smoking this as people are driving by, they like I smell I smell it. It smells delicious. They can they can come swing by absolutely, and have some. Absolutely. Absolutely. So we're at the top of Bonnet Shores, uh, 1014 Boston Neck Road. Okay. Um, give us a call. We'll have it ready for you. You can take it right to the beach. Great to sit on the beach and have some barbecue. Sure. And then, uh, or pick it up on the way home while you're sitting in traffic to come back home. All right. Now I know this is. It takes a long time to learn how to do this. How long have you been? How long have you been uh, a pit master? Uh, I wouldn't call myself a pit master. <laughs> um, I'm I'm a chef by by trade. Okay. Um, so I've been trying. I've been working on it for about 10, 12 years. Okay. Uh, putting it all together, and everything else been cooking for over 20. Yep. And finally decided on barbecue, and mm, it's a success. It's a success. All success. Right. So we're gonna put this together. Go online right now to RodiesDeals.com. Two twenty-five dollar gift certificates for only twenty-five bucks. We'll put this together. Give it a try. Back to you. We are back in the Roadshow Kitchen this morning with Chef Steve from Eddie's Barbecue. There are a roadie deal today. You're going to get two $25 vouchers for the price of one. I love a good deal, and I'm sure they're going to go fast. All right, your name's Steve, Eddie's Barbecue. Who's Eddie? Eddie's my brother. Awesome. Uh, he loves it. The whole business is named after him. <laughs> yeah. um, but it's, yeah, I'm Steve. He's Eddie. Yeah. We'll just kind of go from there. But everyone <laughs> loves barbecue in everybody your family. Loves barbecue. And everyone has been loving your place. You've had it for how, how many uh, years we'll now? It'll be five years in August that the restaurant has been open. Mm -hmm. uh, nine years total with the food truck. The food truck. And you got your culinary degree from Johnson & Wales. I did. So, really, so you know your stuff. Yes. And I love that you've <laughs> then brought your focus to barbecue. And you need some good sides if you're going to make barbecue yes. as well. So uh, let's jump in and, and make our side. So what we have here is we have the, the butternut squash hash. Mm -hmm. And we, uh, we'll start over here. Okay. Just add cubed butternut, probably about inch and a half, inch dice cubes. Mm -hmm. and size. Just add that in. And then, um, so dried cranberries, craisins. Love those, yeah. Whatever you want to use. Um, you might have them in your pantry just to snack on. Absolutely. Throw them in and that here. is good. And then we got a little bit of pepper. Okay. Um, you don't need much. A little bit of pepper goes a long way. These other, these seasonings are so, so nice. So granulated garlic. Mm. I love garlic. Can so never, it must be this one then. Can never have too much garlic. Is this like That's ginger. ginger? Okay. And that, that really kind of brings really it all good. together. And then we have a little bit of oil to put on top. Right, because you need something that, that something way it all it together. together. And then we just, you just kind of mix it together. It's not a hard dish. The hardest part is cutting the butternut. Yeah, always, <laughs> kind of always difficult. They give you a hard time. It makes so, the skins off because that's not something So I, I get peeled and diced. Mm -hmm. So it comes to me already peeled and diced. And hey, you can do uh, that. No, at the I'm sorry, peeled and seated. Well, you can do, get that at the market. Yep. So if you want to save yourself a step and just Absolutely. have someone else cut it for you. <laughs> so then you kind of put it on the pan, mix it all around, even it out. And then from there, about 350 in the oven. I say till mm -hmm. tender, till it's done. So you okay. can kind of yeah, put yeah. your people's ovens are sometimes a little touch different. it. You can put your finger through it. Nice. Good to go. And it's right. a great dish for year round. Uh, we do sell it a is. lot of it, and it's he great. Said, he at said it goes time. fast. It does go fast, and rightfully so. We're gonna pop this in the oven, show you what that looks like when we come back, and then assemble our sandwich. Back in the road show kitchen, our roadie deal of the day is Eddie's Barbecue. Go to roadiedeals.com right now. Two $25 certificates for only 25 bucks. Go down to Narragansett, get yourself some great barbecue. We've got pulled pork Reuben with yeah. butternut squash hash mm. on the menu. We're ready to go. We're going to put this together and give this yeah. a try. All right. So we made our hash in the last segment. So yep. Now so what? this is the, this is the, this is the <laughs> final product. So we can, you can. And there we go. <laughs> there you go. So you can either cook it and then serve it straight from the oven. Yep. Mm -hmm. Or you can cook it the day before, cool it, and then, you know, we just at the restaurant, we'll cook it the day before. Mm -hmm. Here, maybe you make a bit, big batch, so Absolutely. now like, you got the leftovers yeah. the next day. So, you got, so we do that, and then you just kind of put it all in the pan. I was going to say, you put it all in there because it's all going to go. Right. <laughs> we'll eat it. <laughs> we'll eat it. Yeah. So and then you just kind of heat it up so that 
you can go from there. Okay. And then, ready to, you know, heat what it up and serve it. Okay. And so then we have well, a lot got, of other pans on the, on the right. stove top here, so what do we need to do? So while we got that going, we'll put the bread in the middle pan here. Okay. And turn it down a little bit so we don't burn it. You're a fan of the rye? I love marble rye. Mar marble you have rye's no big, idea. Big fan? I think that's my favorite bread. Even when it's offered as like a toast option. You're going sold. with that. <laughs> All right. I'm going with marble rye. So Good. you're having the Reuben today. <laughs> so the full pork Reuben, put it on, starts to melt the cheese and yep. everything else. And then we're going to put the pork and the sour, we mix them. The pork, the sauerkraut, and the avocado chipotle ranch hmm. all together. Right in the pan? Right yet? in the pan. Okay. Ooh, got a good little sizzle. Got to have the sizzle. And it's how all long about did sizzle. that pulled, pulled pork um, have to go for at the, at the restaurant? So the pulled pork cooks for about, we braise it for about three hours. And okay. we do the same thing with the chicken. Uh, we mm -hmm. do a pulled chicken, pulled pork. Um, we have brisket and ribs that we also do that's slow cooked in the oven. Right. Oh, um, yeah. And then we have chicken wings. We sell, a lot, sell a lot of chicken wings. What kind of to, um, so or like sauces for the wings? We, or the, rub that, the rub that we use for the ribs and the brisket, we bake uh, the wings with the rub. Oh, that's probably delicious. Yeah. Yeah. And then we have a barbecue, a buffalo, a buffalo, barbecue. sweet chili, or Parmesan garlic for your that's sauce flavor. Man, that sounds yes. so good. It's, 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 it's making barbecue, you know, smoking different meats like this, there's a lot of trial and error. How long did it take you to kind of get it the way that you want it to be? Mm -hmm. Get it right. So, get it right. I would say it probably took me about two like years that. to really... To be happy with, with what you get, have? To, to get it to where I have it now. Yeah. yeah. Um, I have one friend that can say he's honestly eaten the first barbecue I ever cooked. <laughs> uh, whether he's proud to admit and that or not. He's still your friend. Still my friend. <laughs> so it all worked out. Pork's all heated up. Love that. Well, that's not good. We'll take some of that. That's really good. Put it right on there. And what was the combination again of that aioli in there? Or the so egg? it's um it's barbecue sauce, yeah. ranch, uh, sriracha sauce, cool. and avocados all mixed together. Right. Yum. And then Oh, that sounds take that, good. Put that bread on there. We'll oh, take here, the bread. I have your spatula here too. If that's bread didn't toast up too well. Sure. This right, but even if you just warm it up, and I just see some toasting yep. on that side. All and right. then our hash on the and side the of this. So, so is this something that's always on the menu? I know you said the hash goes quickly just because it's a it's a um, top seller. It does. So we have the Reuben every day. Mm -hmm. um, Ninety percent of the time we do have the hash. Right. Um, the Reuben is a huge seller. I tell yeah. people if you wanted to try something different and do something, you know, taste something a little bit different, to go for the Reuben. Okay. Yeah. Um, it's something it's that's unique on our menu. We have a couple unique items. We have the Reuben. We also have a sandwich called the Mighty Mac, mm -hmm. which is a pulled pork grilled cheese. Oh, yum. Exactly what it sounds like with mac and cheese in the middle of it. Whoa. It's a big sandwich, mm -hmm. huge seller with the college kids. Wow! Yeah, I bet, yeah. <laughs> I bet the it college is. Crew. Or just someone coming home from I the beach, like you is. said, you're in there, such a great location. And then tell us about this little medley plate here. So, th so this would be our two meat combo. You mm -hmm. can get two meats and two sides. Um, we have the brisket and the pulled pork highlighted there, so along good. with uh, the butter, the finished version of the butternut squash mm -hmm. hash, yep. and a potato salad, and then a piece of cornbread that we nice hefty piece we have of cornbread right there. there. Yes. That looks good. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. That looks and then we can mix and match because, like yep. you said, just two meat combo, so we can get ribs. Yep. Pulled so pork. we and we also do a little bit of fried chicken, so you can do you know mm -hmm. pulled pork and ribs, right. pulled chicken and brisket, fried chicken and ribs. Got? And it smells phenomenal in here. Looks so good. how do we plate this up? Just a sandwich so, in the. Take the sandwich. Put it right up on there. So and while you're so doing that, I'm just going to remind everybody it is our roadie deal of the day too. Mm -hmm. So go to roadiedeals.com right now. Two twenty-five dollar vouchers for Ooh. only twenty-five yeah. bucks. Go down to uh, to Eddie's Barbecue, see Steve, so and he can hook you up with some great food. That looks, that looks delicious. delicious. Don't forget, you can find is. the recipe over Ooh. at roadshow.com. Enjoy.